Greetings everybody, I'm Brian D0313. Welcome to our Final Fantasy VI. Last time we did a lot scenario where we had to escape South Fidro. We made a new friend, a traitor. And we're heading back to Narsh now. Today we're going to be doing our next scenario, which is a uh, Team Emo. Which is uh, these three. Terra, Bannon, and Edgar. Fleeing the, the Empire's troops. Bannon, Gerard, and Question Marks ride the rapids toward Narsh. But the drone won't be easy. At least it ever. And we're having fun. Let's have. Nope, don't do that. Have you do that? Have you use auto crossbow and you pray? This is when does praying ever work? Apparently, this praying is good because it heals us. Uh, no new enemies on the Leet River. Uh, keep on rolling, rolling, rolling. Might banish gain the level. Bastards leeching my uh, my experience. Yeah, I really like how they did this, uh, splitting up the parties. That way, uh, everyone gets a little bit of show instead of. Uh, Having too many people on the team. I wish that they did that more in this game. This is the only time that they really split the parties like this. And we're here at Narsh. Cool. So let's see. For Terra. Optimize. Give her Genji gloves. Let's give her... I don't know. Goddess gloves. Make them better. It doesn't really matter what we give him for a sword. Let's give him sprint shoes and army sandals. Make them faster. Cool. Uh, we can't head to south. We could go down to uh, the cave of Figaro, but it'll be blocked off by Imperials. And Figaro Castle still buried underneath the sand. Uh, save up here. And come inside. Let's heal up first. Free heals. Okay, let's set up. Hey! No. I'm the leader of the returners. Wow, beating up an old man, huh? Let's not get hasty here. I'm King Gerard of Figaro. Sure brought your ID, buddy. <laughs> wow. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. Yeah. Suck, Terra. Whatever shall we do? Well, remember... There was a hidden passage over here. When Rosser first is, uh, rescued me, we came out of the mines right around here. He fiddled with something. Yes, he told me. Twist a stone like, like so, and? Secret passage. And we get attacked. There's uh, two new enemies. These are wild rats, which are one of them. I think that they're new enemies. Looks like they're new enemies on the list. That doesn't do anything. So this way. We're outside. I don't think we'd be attacked out here. There's nothing down there. And let's head back inside. This is actually a very, very, very short one. Uh, this is our new enemies, so... Got wild rats and valore, valeror, whatever. Oh, try to just do auto battle here. Wreck everything. Haha. Uh -huh. Draw gain level and tear gain the level.
What is this? It's a, a save point that's just going around in circles? Hmm. This place must, this must be the place. What place? There's a room in here they use to test applicants to the city guard. We should be fine as long as we follow the light. If we make our mistake, the light surrounds us. Then we'll have to tag the glimmer and orange light to proceed. Okay, then. Uh, yeah. In the SNES version, I think that they said that this was a, um... Um, they said it was something... Oh, um, uh, like a uh, defense mechanism. So if, uh... Oh, we can't run. If you go the wrong way, this happens. And you have to press the orange dot to continue. Don't do a battle. And you fight these dudes. Uh, these dudes actually, I guess they don't have... Everyone says, uh, enemies in the light maze doesn't have a B-Siri entry. Make sure to fight them or you'll permanently lose Gal's rage achievements. So, yeah, so they're not in the B-Siri, but we still get the rages. Um, you got the dark side. Specter and a Yura Yura Yo Yoto. And if you screw up, you have to start all over again. So let's just assume that it's a security system to prevent people from coming in. It's pretty bad if they tell us like the actual path. I just want to be sure. I'm going to do this again. Not the auto battle this time. Oh, oh my god, stop doing the auto battle. Now I thought that we would see all three of them in the same battle, but apparently not. I, I always thought that these guys were the ones that we only f that we fought. I don't remember the other two. Yes, I know the pathway already. I'm guessing if you want to speed run, you could just uh, just bypass it. Uh, dark side. Okay. Okay, so yeah, I'm guessing that we, uh, yeah, we had to have killed all, th all the enemies here. What I'll do is just, I'll off screen try and get the, uh, the battle with three enemies again. Okay, uh, I just looked at the video. We did get all the, uh, new enemies for here, so let's just do this the right way. I tried grinding up the enemies, but... I couldn't find I couldn't find the other two. I just kept on running to those uh the dark sides. Let's do this let's do this the right way. I didn't mean to go that way. And freedom! <laughs> Back into territories where we would be attacked. Murder! Now, remember, this was a place where we uh, we fought with the Moodles, or Locke, where uh, well, Locke fought with the Moodles. But we didn't get to come up here. But there's Moodles! Hey! Koopo! Koopo! You're not moving. What's up with you? Huh? Koopopo? Weird. Okay, so there's a treasure right there. Do not open it. It has a rune blade in it, but later on it turns into something really awesome. So down here, which is just south of uh, the doorway that we went in. Is that treasure? More treasure that we're skipping. And we're 
right here. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to strip everyone naked. Yes, I like to have naked party members. They're so naked. Haha. <laughs> That's it. This one's pretty quick. And we're back. We're back, old man. Hey. Yes. Arvis, how do things stand here, Narsh? I'm starting to think, is he a ginger? I wonder why he's so evil. Why would anyone want to side with the Returners? They're on the losing side. How's he know who I am? How are the townspeople? Why are you uh, looking at my boobs? We believe Tara may be able to help us get answers to our questions about the Esper. Oh, well, so we don't approach them the wrong way. That Esper is either going to save us or did us in an early grave. I say the latter. Okay, that was pretty quick. I say maybe 10 minutes. So let's get started on Sabins, which is by far the longest of the three scenarios. So I'm just going to uh, scroll down. I'm just looking at stuff. Because I, really, I didn't really prepare for this. Because there's a lot going on with Savin's tail. Cool. Hey! What dire fate has befallen Lesnar, who leaped from the raft after the fight with Ultros? I'm sure he's fine. Or he's over here. Okay then. So let's see. Optimize you. If you don't really care about the Genji gloves, we'll give him the earrings because that boosts his magic. We'll give him the sprint shoes as well. And bam. And let's just get attacked right away. Um, there are four new enemies, I believe, on the overworld. This is one of them. Uh, Chip Rabbit, I think. Shoot in the face of my laser. Knows how much more damage we're doing because of the fact that we have the earrings on. I'd just say that this one's a little bit more challenging due to the fact that we don't actually get a healer here. So we have to pretty much rely on uh, healing items. You're a soldier. Probably not. Let's take a look. And we got stuff here. We only have one Phoenix down. Let's, uh. Can't buy in like groups of ten. Don't buy five. Got two tents. I should have probably stolen more of these. Uh, shurikens, invisibility, scroll, and shadow scrolls. They're throwing items. You don't have any ones that you throw, though. Bye. Uh, but hey, it's Clyde. Don't get too close. He doesn't like strangers. You, another traveler. You don't happen to know how I could get to Narsh, do you? To separate from my friends. The Emperor, the Emperor has set up camp just beyond the forest in the east. The Emperor? 
What are they doing here? They seem to have their eyes on Doma Castle. So, Doma's next, huh? But I need to get to Narsh right away. If your only road pa passes through Doma, I can take you there if you'd like. Just know that I may leave, I may leave you at any time. Uh, sure. Death always is always just a step behind me. And now we have Clyde on our team. So he's an assassin. Uh, he's level 11. Maybe it's an average of all the characters that we have instead of just like the ones that are in our current party. Uh, he has no abilities at all. Let's see, he starts with a kunai, ninja gear. Let's optimize him. Cool. Now, as he said, he uh, he might leave us at any time, which is possible. Um, let's see if the guide has anything about this. It's kind of funny that it doesn't really come with much equipment. Uh, yeah, so they don't really, um, the guy doesn't really say anything about, uh, the percent chance of him leaving after every battle, but what happens is, after every battle, he has a chance to leave the party. So, he's kind of a dick like that. He just, he just leaves, and he'll steal all your equipment as well. Fucking asshole. That's why I'm not going to give him any relics, because I don't want to lose them. Definitely don't want to give him the Genji gloves or, or, uh, like, the ribbon. Um, he has these special abilities to throw, which lets him throw stuff. He also has another special ability, which we'll see soon enough. Um, I don't think that there's any treasure here. Hey, who are you? Huh? Uh, no, I'm a muscle man. Well, why don't you fix it yourself? Do you like live in the middle of nowhere? Where is the clock? I don't see a clock. Can I sleep in your bed? Ha ha! Doesn't even give a shit that I'm sleeping in his bed. Oh, that's hero tax for you. Can I drink your uh, alcohol? No, can I play with this? <gasps> God damn it. I'm sorry. Apparently this guy doesn't like kids. Wait, what's the belt? Why would he toss me there? Two? So he's done this before? So he tosses all repairmen onto the belt? I think that's us talking. interact with more things. Does he say anything else? I thought he said more things. Oh, there we go. A wall mower? Those things even exist? I'm not a wall mower. I tried fixing the damn stove. He yelled at me. So I, I guess he just loops around. Ah, well, if you're crazy, I'm out of here. Let's uh, save. Pro um, if you want, you might want to save after every battle, just because with with uh, Clyde here. But uh, thanks to uh, thanks to the Steam version, we now know where we, want, where we have to go. Um, this guy is an AP Orinus. Or Cannibal kick his ass. Because Sabin just murders everything. 
That's enemy two of three. Or two of four, that is. Find him south. Um, chipper, chipper rabbits. I think we already fought these dudes. Now there's now. If you're not doing the B series, that's fine. But there's definitely one enemy that you want to be on the lookout for here. It's a very important enemy. Um, I'll do this later. Uh, Zandu guy? No, we already fought the big bird. Okay, well. Uh, God damn it. So, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to look for the enemies after this battle and just cut in the battle afterward. And hopefully Clyde doesn't leave us. Okay, here's uh, another new enemy. We have... Nettle Hoppers. Nettle Hopper. Nothing too special about them either. And cool. Okay, so one more enemy to be on the lookout for. The one that we care about the most. Okay, and here we go. We got the final enemy, the most important, the stray cat. And we'll see why they're important soon enough. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Let's go over here. The Imperial camp. <gasps> there are awful lot of soldiers here. What's up, dudes? Not really doing too well at Garden's place. You can't even see me. Uh, no. Who would name you Soldier A and Soldier B? That's like the worst names possible. Uh, I doubt Keffy's around. Who's this General Leo? Shh! Dude! Yeah, don't want to be locked up. Oh, there's Jeffy. Back to work! Hey, you! You're keeping a sharp lookout, hmm? Please, spare me your petty talk. Just do your job. And don't let me catch you stacking, or I'll make you regret being born. Bye, Kefi. Dipshit. Hey, what's wrong with him? Idiot. Haha, <laughs> twisted. Yeah? Is there a frontal assault? What about the other guy that's like just walking back and forth into the tent? Oh, there's people here. This is probably that castle that people were talking about. That guy must be special because he's wearing black. Charge! And he's a captain. Um, what are they doing? They're like Falling over, they're trying to climb uh, tall walls. It's like the worst attack ever. Like, who would ever think that would work? Dude, they're like just falling over the walls. They're not even breaching the, the exterior. How are you like complaining? Oh, we keep, can't keep them out. It's not even like they're uh, shooting artillery at us, especially with their tanks. Yep, this is it. We have failed. Apparently, we don't have any defenses at all. Like, we can't use our... This place is, apparently doesn't have any soldiers. It doesn't have any, uh, like, bows and arrows and things like that. Nope. Nothing at all. Wait. Wait, 
Do I look like a waiter? This guy. Look at that mustache. The battle's not yet lost. What's up, old man? A noble warrior of a foreign land, a faithful retainer to his lord and master. He fears not even death. What is it, Zach? What is a retainer, anyway? Cyan? You're not Cyan. That's bullshit. You're Cena. Do, 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 do. Yeah, Cena's back. He's back in black. After Dragon Warrior 3. He's gonna be kicking ass and taking names. Effing the shit out of everyone. If we can put. But, uh, but fell their commander. They should break rank and withdraw. But there's so many of them. There's like, I don't know, how many? Ten soldiers and the commander? Whatever shall we do? I shall meet them on the field of battle. Uh, you go do that. There's only three of us, though. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I think there's two more guys down below. Um, why do I defeat them? Why don't the three of us defeat defeat them? Like we're just standing here. They're not doing anything. Like you got that one guy. That's there's two guys like just walking back and forth. You got two guys that are like just walking up and down. You have the guy over to the left that's walking into the wall. At least you have one guy. He's, he's making some effort of trying to climb the wall. But other than that, it's like this is so pointless. It's the worst assault ever. Where are they going? And make matters worse. Like, look at us. There's just there's three of us, and there's more. There's more. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven plus commander. And no one seems to give a shit about killing us. We could just walk through them this whole time. No one cares. Makes you wonder how the Empire uh, got so advanced. If we talk to them. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey! I'll be into a battle. Oh, I should have showed this guy off. Uh, he has Bushido. It works differently in this game compared to uh, the SNES version and probably other versions. Are these guys new or are they different? Uh, Imperial Soldier. Uh, we'll meet up with them soon enough. We meet up with them uh, elsewhere here, but I'll uh, just kill them for the B-Serie entry. Oh, he's gone, so I guess we could kill them all. It's kind of funny, like, oh, one guy killed everyone? The smart thing to do was just would be to just gain up on this guy and kill him. Okay, so we got John Cena. He's a samurai? Okay. Uh, he's level 13. He has, uh, well, he has Bushidos. And they all have, uh, things. So, in how they worked in the S SNS version is, is that there's a total of eight Bushidos, and what you do, well, they're called, they were called, uh, sword text back then. And what happened is, in battle, if you were to click it, uh, you had to wait a certain amount of time. This is number one, so you can use this instantly, but if you want number two, you had to wait a little bit of time. Three, a little bit even more time, and eight would take the longest. So what you're doing is, you click on sword tech, and there's this like timer thing that's just like going up and up. And you can't do anything else, you can't have anyone else act until you decide to, oh yeah, we want to do this number. So it kind of made things a little bit tricky because of the fact that, well, your, your other party members will be acting in the battle, but no, they're not because of the fact that you're trying to boost up the Bushidos. But in this version, however, it's different. You could just select the Bushido and set the timer going up, and then you could just switch our characters and do their things, and then uh, this guy would independently have his own timer that would just like flip and flip and flip until it gets to the right one. Fane being the first one, Sky's number two, Titer's number three. Um, as he gains levels, as, uh, he'll get uh, more abilities, and later on he'll get something that'll, that'll teach him all the Bushidos. So uh, this one performs a rapid sword thrust against a single enemy, so it's a powerful attack, as we saw. Uh, 
This one, when attacked in battle, he will uh, counterattack. I don't really see the use of it. And this one. Okay, so this one is like a demo, uh, demi where it uh, halves the enemy's HP. Sort of useless. I would probably most of the time I use I would use Fane or number four or number seven. There's equipment. Yeah, it's a Tatana. Optimize. And I think if we give them Genji gloves, he'll do uh, two Bushidos instead of one. So I want to give him that. Oh wait, no, he doesn't have any other weapons. Uh, uh Hermes Sandelson and Goddess gloves. Straight. I don't know. That's good. I don't. I think most of his Bushidos are based on attack power. And that's his stuff. Hey, how you doing? Why can't you defeat him? Can I go back inside the castle? Tuh. You would turn your back, John Cena. Oh, I can't talk... <laughs> I can't talk to these guys. Oh, let's fight the commander. Let's see how bad this goes. I am Cena, retainer to the king of Doma. Ready thy axe! He has an axe? Is that really an, an axe? Is it? Yeah, it is. It is an axe. It's funny how I guess he equips things that uh, aren't really in his inventory. Like, they're in Savin's inventory. Why would he have the Hermes sandals? And he's dead. Goodbye, uh, Captain. And for our troubles, we get Black Belt. I guess that's sort of a mini boss. Black Belt's pretty good. Oh no, the Captain's dead. Let's retreat. We failed. Still doesn't make any sense at all. Withdraw to the castle. We shall wait within its walls while our enemies grow tired without. Well, but if we don't go on the offensive, then what's the point? They'll probably just bring more soldiers from the Empire. Now, this always seems to happen. Whenever, after that scene, uh, your party gets reorganized. So, I guess, like, if the Sabin was your party leader, now Shadow's the party leader. Vice versa. I've never seen what happens if uh, Shadow's the party leader. Let's just swap these two up. Hey, how you doing? How's the guard patrol? Making sure that no one's getting in here, huh? 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 Yeah, you're doing pretty good there, buddy. Oh, that dog has red eyes. Can't talk to him. Open. Um, kick it. Ow. Uh oh. No, he heard me. Uh, I think we've seen these dudes before. Doberman? Have we seen Dobermans before? No, we. I don't think we've seen Dobermans before. I wonder why they're not on the uh, checklist here. Oh! Ah, uh, so uh, we have to get the chest, otherwise we're fucked here. Oh, I, I turned the freaking thing back on. And inside we get ourselves a star pendant. Which does what? Prevents poison. Oh, we have the ribbon. Oh yeah, we also got the uh, black belt, which is pretty cool. What it does is it gives, when attacked in battle, it gives the character a chance to counterattack. Water looks pretty crappy. Look at it; it's like black. Oh shit! There's a tank here. By the way, both, uh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but both Sabins, Blitzes, and, uh, 
and Cyan's uh, Bushidos, they just randomly attack an enemy. I need to heal up. At least we got a high potion from that. Aha, uh -huh, we're doing quite well here. <gasps> Still not. Who is that? Oh, that's General Leo. Domens. Wait. General Leo's black? What the hell? This is just mind blowing. Better watch out. Might get uh, gunned down by traps. Nah, that's not cool because the traps are actually useful. I guess they used the strategy beforehand? Yeah, just like last time, huh? What about the last assault? The only, there's only one, actually two casualties. <laughs> Why? Why would you lay down your life? It's like, you have no purpose in life then. Might as well just take a gun to your head. Mar Miranda? I thought it was uh, M-I-R. That strikes from Miranda. It actually says something different in the SNES version. I think it's just a mistranslation. He's, I think it says like something like, uh, you have fall, uh, fallen battle, something like that. I'm sure you can handle it, Mr. Leo. This guy actually makes some sense. <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't want you to die for nothing. Hey! How do you feel about being in command, buddy? Oh, wonder what the uh, Emperor wants from us. Huh? But, you're in charge. Who will lead us? There's no other generals here, and I'm probably just a lowly private. Wait, you're leaving? The Seriously? As I said, this guy's probably like a private or an, 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 uh, another enlisted character. He can't command. You're like losing your mind here, General Leo. Yes, don't rush things. Don't let me down! Yeah, he seems like a good guy, pretty noble. I think that also that was Nura uh, said something else different in the SNES version. I think it says you could be, be my friend if you weren't my enemy already. Oh, let's press forward. Hey, there's a thing over there. Thin with claws. Hey, it's Caffey. What are you up to, Caffey? When Leo's gone, I could turn this water into a flowing river of poison. Anyone who touches it will have to be pushing up daisies. Hee <laughs> hee Hey. Is he talking to himself? Well, it's pretty convenient for Caffey that uh, the Emperor called him back. Hmm, I take care of things faster than you ever would. Well, Kefi's not in charge, the other guy's in charge. Yeah, don't forget about that, Kefi. We need to show mercy to those who side with the returners. Which is good, because I never seem to have any of the stuff. What stuff? What's he talking about? <gasps> We're not going to talk to Leo? Yes! You just go off and be a good little boy. And here comes uh, the acting general. Is the poison ready? Yes. Leo's not here anymore. I'm in charge now. Fork it over. Um. So how do we plan out poison in them? Like a. It's not that we're going to be spoon-feeding uh, this poison to them. 
Who cares? They're the ones who were stupid enough to get caught by the enemy. Wow. Hearing that, I would definitely leave the Empire. Yes, let's just go kill our people. Then our ranks are even more. You're inhuman. I may that they don't have someone say that. I guess they assume that maybe either Shadow or Sabin is the party are the party leaders. I should just have Shadow say it, or uh, Sabin say it. Yeah, pet that every turn. Guess I'll have to take care of you too. Please don't be out of battle. Okay, so we got we got Kefi. Finally, for the first time, for the last time. Let's use this blitz that we didn't use. The meteor strike. Oh ho! Suplex City, motherfucker! Yes! Kefi, wait! Wait, he says. Do it look like a waiter? And Shadow's like, what the fuck? Wait! Okay then. So, uh, hi Kefi. Bye Kefi. In here, there should be a treasure. What? I got the star pendant. I got that. There should be one more treasure. Try and figure out where this other treasure is because I didn't really think it existed. So we just walk around. Where is everyone? There's like no one guarding this place. We should just jump into a tank and kill everyone. Uh, so these things are powering up the tanks. I'm not sure what happens if we talk to that guy. Where the hell is this barrier right now? Let me just look at this thing. Um, Imperial camp. Green beret, star pendant, mithril gloves. And a remedy. Where do you get the remedy from? Looks like there's a barrier ring. Unless that this is hacked in. It shows up being in a tent right near the water. And the water's to the right. I know where you are, I know where you are. Where is this? The way you look in here, there's mental gloves. you do? Uh, when the weird gets control HP, cast protect, which reduces the team physical attacks. Let's start HP. Let's, uh, push it up. And check you. Monster in the box. Uh, this is a satellite. Then if we attack it, it'll, uh, summon an enemy. It should summon an enemy. Uh, since it's flying, it can't really, uh, we can't suplex it. He's going to, uh... Ah, uh, he's going to berserk him. There we go. And he's just going to call, uh, call some of his soldier friends. And now he's blind. Take down. Yeah, so if you saw that weird shield that uh uh that shadow's using, that's uh that's his dog. Oh my god. And there he is again. 
Where are you, Phoenix Down? Let's bring you back to life. Probably at critical HP. No! Fuck! Wasted that. Goodbye. Dipshit. Never got Dream Beret for our efforts. I think that's the helmet. Increases the de uh, defense. Uh, cap that provides one eighth bonus to match HP. Cool. Green berets are usually pretty good. Uh, you, let's give him a ribbon. Get rid of that blind stat. And let's remove the ribbon so he doesn't abandon us. And heal up. I still don't know where this uh, tent is. It's on. Like, it looks real. It looks like it's supposed to be right here. But there's, uh, there's no tree there. And there's no boxes. I know for a fact that there's no other places where there's water to the right. Oh, there it is. Let's see what if we talk to this guy. Oh, they won't let us talk to him. Oh, let's prevent him from uh, poisoning peeps. Wait. Death Pit. You just don't give up, do you? That'll look good. Once you hit him, he'll be like he'll be like a pussy like Sarasser. And he says the same exact thing again. Bye. Yeah, how long do you expect me to put up with this? Next time I won't hold back. That's because we'll kill you. Oh great, this is getting tiresome. Hey, you handle the rest. Hey! Okay, so what do we have here? We have Templars and Imperial Soldiers. Uh, Templars definitely want to kill. I'm not sure if they've run from battle. But either way, definitely want to kill them because they'll come in handy later on. Whoa. That was tough, man. Good block. Okay. Oh, what are you up to, Caffey? Hee hee hee. Nothing beats the sweet music of hundreds of voices streaming in unison. Ew hee hee. So I'm guessing he has a vial of poison, which is not the. Not that much. And he pours it, uh, pours it into a, a flowing river that has millions of parts of water. So it's probably like one part of poison to like millions of parts of water. So by the time it gets to a person, they drink the water. It's probably gonna be like super, super diluted to the point where you just don't get a little tummy ache. That's my, that's my theory. And it turned the water purple, so, like, right away you don't think something's suspicious about the water. What's up, dude? Oh, they better not be. What's going on? Eh, it probably can't look that odd. Hmm, does the water not look a bit odd? It's purple. What's wrong? Do these guys drink the Kool-Aid? They better not drink the Kool-Aid. It's purple. How can you not see that's purple? Even Cy even Cyan saw that was purple. 
Apparently everyone's dying except for these two. They're the only smart ones that didn't drink anything. <gasps> Must be poison! We must warn the king. Oh, it's so slow. King, where are you, king? Hey! Yes, to the throne room, it's just ahead. I was just looking for something. Oh, no! He's dead! Your Highness! It's me! Your retainer! Hope the good news is, is if he dies, I think I become the new king. So, uh... Ah, uh, he's fine. Cena, Your Excellency. Oh, Cena. Wait, you still hear me? Excellency, please, you must be strong. I still don't get how everyone just drank this water. Time. Yes, you failed big time. You failed to prevent people from drinking purple water. No, Excellency. The fault lies not with thee. Oh, baby. Speak not, my lord. Save thy strength. My family? I have a family? Excellency. It's dead. I think. Oh, there's the only other smart person here. There's gotta be more survivors, right? There may be still be survivors in the castle. Yeah, let's check it out. Can I talk to you? He's dead. Let's go outside, let's look around. Oh, that guy didn't end up too well. Hey, he looks dead. He's just taking a nap. Yeah, a long time ago, I didn't know he could actually walk down here. Because it's like the building, it's like, it's over, it's the overhang. So it's just seen better days. The fans apparently aren't working. And we can't walk over them. There's nothing here as far as I know. It's so slow. Only we had auto sprint. You okay? Here too. I think we need to get treasure. We should be able to. Oh, we got remedy. Nice. Hey. Yes, we were. We didn't try hard enough. I wish I gave you the sprint shoes. And we can't go down there. Okay. Oh, let's check the room right next to the king's room, which is obviously our bedroom. Oh no! My wife. Regina! Do not leave me, Elena. But the sun. This. This is unpardonable. Wayne. Just pulls him right out of bed. No. No. This is not possible. This cannot be happening. It's a dream. Can we get the treasure chest? I will not forgive them. The emperor must pay for this. Okay. I am Cena, retainer to the King of Doma, who's dead. Oh, hi. Yes, two first one. <gasps> it's a dude. Now, now that we gain control again, we can actually go. Wait, what? Oh, I want to go up there, though. I guess I can't go back this way either. Hello. Blocking your pathway, huh? Can't talk to them. Hey! Let me give you a hand. 
I know not thy name or allegiance, but I want of thy aid. Teamwork. Um, auto battle. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Wanna join the team yet? Grrr. Three more. And somehow shadows in front of you. <laughs> Asshole. These ones next. Grr, they are tougher than they they would appear. Yeah, it's all a battle. Bye. Come on, join us. Look, I think we're going to have to do this together. The thought, the thought had occurred to me as well. I should give him an accent. Another Templar with an axe. Can you do something more useful, buddy? Hey, look. Why can't it be like, uh, Sabin? Join the team! I am in thy debt. No need for thanks. I'm Lesser from the Kingdom of Figaro. We should get out of here. But I must have, but I must avenge my family and my countrymen. If we sit around here any longer, we'll have an entire rich regiment down our throats. Yes, let's flee. Oh boy. I have an idea. Follow me. Uh, Sir Lesnar, what manner of armored beasts might these be? The tanks? I'll explain later. Just climb in. Push them. Sir Lester, how does one manipulate these abominations? Oh my god! They are being getting. Uh, they are be. are getting to be quite a pain in the break. Now I'm even starting to talk like you. Listen, see that lever? The one right by your hand? Push it down. Wait a sec. How am I supposed to get this treasure? Oh my god! It's out of control! Let's get out of here. Now get how we're supposed to get in there. to the picture that it I think that is tent but as far as I can tell there's no way to get in there but it's so nice to be riding taints again got a match attack fire beam let's just uh, wreck him oh Guys can't stop us. Hmm, maybe you're supposed to get it after you talk to him for the first time. I'll have to check that. Why are we heading this way? Aren't we supposed to be heading south? Okay then. Okay. I think we should be safe now. So how do we get to Nars from here? 
Norse. I believe the only route passes through the forest to the south, but... All right. If we're going into the woods, I guess we won't be needing these hunts of scrap metal anymore. Why? They're so awesome. So we left to the north in order to go south in order to get past this checkpoint. Nothing makes sense. Okay, so... I'm gonna reload my save and get attacked here. And then from there, I'll see if I can get that item. So, see you shortly, hopefully. Okay, people, when we're back, uh, this took a while. I, I just want to point out that I did not know about this treasure for as long as I lived since, uh, since I first played this game. I didn't, I didn't know about its existence. I actually had to look this one up. And it's kind of interesting that it's on the Steam Guide. It was on the Steam uh, B Series slash Item Guide. However, it's not on the guide that I'm looking at, and it wasn't in the uh, Nintendo Power Strategy Guide. So, this one's a very rare treasure. I guess what I need to do is come up here and jump up here. Is that here? We get a barrier ring. I don't know. Did did anyone else know about this? It's like so awkward. I wonder if this was actually in the original SNES version or if it was in the uh, advanced version. But uh, yeah, there's a spot that you can jump here. And when you jump, you automatically come into the tent. And when you leave the tent, you automatically jump back up. And this is, uh, like, right after you attack Captain for the first time. And yeah, that's pretty cool. This is a very, uh, barrier ring to do anyway. Cast shell when the wearer, wearer is almost dead. Okay. Cool. So, uh, I just don't finish up this place again and meet you outside for the next episode. So, until then, it's been Brian D0313 saying, See ya and have a good day. Come back, bitch.